Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Node.js. So today we are going to learn how to upload the images on the Cloudinary with the help of the Node.js and the Malta. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please to subscribe my channel and if you like the video, please to like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. So here we have the main file that is called the server.js where we have the all the code over here. Okay. And I will show you first what exactly it is. So here we go with the API endpoint. So here I need to add my key. Okay, so what's the key name is here? That is user photo. So I'm going to add my user photo here, body, user photo. And here I'm going to upload one of the video images. So go with the download downloads and here any of the images. I can use finding cloudinary API key and all I'm selecting this image okay selected send file uploaded can we check right now and then we have a cloudinary sign up I have already logged in with this one user so might be it's come up with all the details So here we have the media library. Here you can see that the image which I have uploaded finding your Cloudinary API key which is there right now. Okay, so how we are going to do that and upload this on the Cloudinary. Let's have a look on that one. So first we have to use the express. Then this is a Yotels Cloudinary. Cloudinary. Here we have the all the keys over here. So API key, API secret. And if you don't know how to get this one, we have already the video to how to get this Cloudinary API key, cloud name and the secret. Okay. If you don't know about that one, if not getting one, then just let me know in the comment section. Right. Next, we have the Malta. We have to install. Then we have Express already installed. Then Malta, this storage where the destination you want to upload. If you want, if you don't want to upload onto your local system, then avoid this step. Okay. So you don't need to pass the destination. You have to just pass the file name if you want to add it into your local storage it depends on to you if you want to use or not then we have the multi okay so here we have the multi storage then the, the name of the file that you want to accept that is user photo okay so here which use express json and the limit is 550 mb okay and this is basically you can see about the method of the body that should be able encoded whether it's to be a json so both is passing over here okay Next, the main API that is API upload. Okay, so here we have the upload method. Here you can see that upload, upload dot request response. If the error, then the error is turning any of uploading the file. Then we are just receiving the request dot file dot path. We are getting the file path. Then we are passing in the file string of the Cloudinary. So this is the Cloudinary uploader, Cloudinary dot uploader dot upload here. And you have to pass the upload preset. This is important. Make sure it should be there. Upload preset you need to pass. And if you don't know how to get the upload preset, you can also check out my previous video how to get the upload preset. Or you are getting any issue, you will also get the video on my tutorial. Okay. Then file is uploaded. Simple. What we have to do first, we have upload use the multi to get the file path. Then we are uploading this one with the help of the a cloudinary api here cloudinary uploader upload file string you have to just pass the file string over here if you don't want to use the multi you can also avoid but here you can make sure that should be a file string the file path should be there then you can upload with the help of this method okay that that this is the short code that you can see that nothing big on that okay so this is how you are able to upload the images whether it's to be a csv or anything you can upload using the cloudinary okay any doubt, any query in that, just let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.